Hi everybody! It is now four minutes till four o'clock and it is the first day back for Hawaii State Teachers. As you can see, I'm oily, I'm gross, I'm stressed. Don't know if that comes across in this video but I am. I'm trying to be silly, I'm trying to be positive because pretty much all through summer I was not. So I'm trying. We just got uh, the memo that 109 new COVID cases today happened. So yeah, it is Wednesday. So it's right in the slab middle of the week. I'm actually one of the last people here on campus because I have extra things to do. Oh yeah, let's take a look at my checklist, shall we? These are the things that I need to get done. I actually, oh wait, let me cross that out. Do, 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 do. This is so hard doing it with a camera. I still have to make a professional development Oops, slide because I volunteered myself to lead a professional development. So I don't know why I did that, but kind of looking forward to it. Um, I still have time to work on that, so I'm not really worried about that. I have to write a PO because uh, I'm even using a PO. I don't even know at this point. Yeah, let's talk about that. The kids can't share anything, so I can't buy supplies i actually have a lot of pencils already so if students need that i don't really think i need to worry about that we're supposed to be well our principal said that we do have some ppe already so we're just waiting to get that in our hands in our rooms so there's not really much that i can buy really for the room it's going to be mostly online we'll only see the students for one hour once a week so one one day a week oh my gosh my brain yeah i'm fried i don't really think for the first time i'm gonna make a po really because everything is pretty much going to be digital i presume so let's get back to this list okay so i have to read up on a student's iep this is wishful thinking i oh gosh it's so blurry i put down i need to clean out my google drive and i need to review um the cte agenda if you've been watching my previous videos and instagram posts i am now teaching a brand new class i'm in the creative arts and technology academy so our cte pathway course is arts and communications so i've never taught it before um i've definitely never taught it online either so that's gonna be new okay can i just say one thing i'm loving these earrings that i got guess where i got them from guess guess icing i really like them i usually don't dress up as you can see like if you look at my outfit i've worn this in another video before this is nothing new and yes, it's a school t-shirt. Nothing fits. I have no pants that fit me. So I'm wearing leggings. I'm trying to cover up how um, poor this is put together and how basic this look is by having cute earrings that match my cute shoes. You can see my shoes. Yeah. I don't even know what to talk about really at this point. I'm exhausted. I did not get to document any part of my day today because it was our first day back, a very different first day back, unlike any other first day back before. I need to go home. I need to not think about school. I need to just turn off my laptop and not even think about this at all, which is gonna be really hard. The three hour faculty meeting that we had this morning just made me more stressed. They keep giving us more information, more or less, if I'm even making sense. And it's just making me more confused. It's making me more stressed. It's making me feel like I thought I knew what I was going to teach and how I was going to teach it online, but I guess not now, so. Oh, update before I go. We were supposed to have students come back physically on August 4th, which is next week. However, the Board of Education is having another meeting. They're calling it an emergency meeting. Us teachers are wanting more training because it's already Wednesday, and so we would only have 
Thursday, Friday to really get ready and to set up the room and everything, which that is impossible at this point. Because our union is asking for more training and more time to give the best education to Hawaii students, we probably are not gonna have kids back physically until August 17th. I'm counting my blessings. It's probably going to be approved by the board. So we hope that's gonna happen because there's just no way if students come back, logistically, there's just no way. Even me, I can navigate my way through learning social distance learning platforms, but I haven't excelled at it. We need that time, we, we need it, you know, that I need it. <laughs> I hope you all have a wonderful day, a wonderful week. I will see you all when I see you all. Bye.